So here's my 2013 iMac, and I did open a legacy patch on here. I put Sonoma on here. because The reason I did that was, one, uh, Safari doesn't work. It's not supported. No more updates. No more operating system updates. And App Store, apps don't work anymore, or at least modern apps. So I did that. Runs great, but I'm curious, is there going to be any kind of updates? And I think there may be, because you can see down here, there is a little one. I think if we go into general, software update, and you can see Mac OS Sonoma 14.4.1. So I'm going to apply this guy. Let's do update now and see if she still works. I'm going to agree with that. And she's downloading. So I kind of want to make this more useful. Basically, it was us usable. You could, with Google, uh, Chrome, you can surf the internet, watch YouTube, and all those fun things. But like I said, a lot of the, the App Store stuff, you know, the modern apps uh, don't work anymore because I think they support the, like, the last three or four versions of the operating system. And the last thing was on here, I can't remember, was it Catalina? I think the last thing this one supported. So with the Open Legacy Patcher, that let me update this to a modern operating system. So the latest and grace. And I tell you what, it functions fine. It's a slight bit slower. Yes, it is a little slower, a smidgen but still fully functional. So I paid 50 bucks for this, so I'm gonna get my 50 bucks out of it. So I tell you, let's let this download, let's see we're at 700 meg, it's, ooh, 13 gigabytes. So quite a bit, 12 minutes remain. So I tell you what, let's come back in 12 minutes and take a look and see what it does. A little update, you can see it's preparing it now. So about 35 minutes remaining. So we'll come back in about 35 minutes. Okay, so I get OpenCore Legacy Patcher has detected you're running without root patches and would like to install them. Graphic Intel Haswell networking modem wireless. Absolutely. And we put in our password. And it looks like it's kind of back here. Let's get him out of the way. Let's see, what's he say? Root patching. Okay. It looks like it's rebuilding kernel. So it looks like we're doing some patching. Maybe this is something I didn't do anyway. Root patcher finished successfully. Okay, reboot. Uh, just do it. <clears throat> so I get a taste of how long it takes to boot with the Sonoma on here. So got the ding. Let's click on him. Did we get it? There we go. And this is after doing all the updates, so maybe it might take a little longer. We'll see. It was like maybe 20, 30 seconds to do a full boot. Like I said, this is the, uh, I have to do an update, so maybe a little bit longer. There you go, not too bad. Get our password in. And we'll just kind of check and see if we got Wi-Fi and all the, all the fun stuff. Uh, yeah, my keyboard, keyboard is low. Let's try the internet. Mr. Chrome. Oh, did we get it? Okay, that looks good. Let's try Safari. And that is fine. Let's see, let's see what up did it update this? About Safari. Uh, 17.4.1. Let's look at the operating system. So quit Safari. Bought this Mac. We got Sonoma 14.4.1. There we go. So it looks like we did get updated. 
forking that 4.1. That's cool. So it looks like it is successful. I think so that was the whole point of this is being able to get security updates because you don't want to be doing um, uh, running your your PC without modern security updates. And this looks like it works great. Let's see if we get a should get a Chrome update here too. Let's let it check. So it's kind of nice. I really like Chrome. I think uh, from what I've seen using Safari, it's kind of hit or miss. Bluetooth, we got Wi Fi. Oh, look at all the networks it sees. That is a lot of networks. Okay, we got to relaunch it. It did its update. There we go. And this should be uh, 123.0. Try them again. And let's go to Bing just for fun. There we go. Yeah, it was just wait for its update to finish. So, anyway, there you go. Success. Looks good to me. So, it's kind of neat that we can still do updates on older hardware. And it does work. So, Open Legacy Patcher, really nice.